shopping. I'm sorry I didn't do an intro clip for this, so I decided to just, hey, get on here and do a voiceover. So we are shopping at Burlington. And I went to Burlington to get these two particular shoes, gym shoes that I've just shown you guys, the pink pair and this orange pair that I absolutely love. I already have an idea of how I want to style them. So now I'm just talking about how I've seen some other shoes that I want to show you guys. And I'm talking about these boots. They remind me uh, Duke for like the Prada. They just don't have like the little pouch on the side. But guys, it was only $24.99. And you can kind of wear them in the summer if it's not too hot where you live. And the fall because it has those holes on the side. And then also I was showing you guys these. I actually seen some shoes like these at a, I think it was a Goodwill or something. But anyway, I was debating on getting those, but I ended up not getting them. And then I saw these and I just thought they would be so comfy. But since I already had like the pink Avis shoes, gym shoes, I decided not to get those. I decided to opt out of those. So now at this point i'm just looking at other shoes burlington for me i always find like just good shoes at a reasonable price and i actually found these like these Bottega sock gym shoes kind of like a dupe and they were only ten dollars but i never found in my size i was just standing up there looking and saw them in the nine and a half i never saw them in my size so i put those back and i just continued to look to see what else i could find and like i said i always find good quality shoes at a good reasonable price anytime i go to burlington so i'm gonna have to kind of cut the auto off on hit this part because the basket was really 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 shaky and so now i'm just glancing through before i get out of there and probably glance at a few of the clothing and i stumbled across these right here and i thought they were really cute they were some pumas and they was white but they had like the black puma like you just seen striped down the front of them and i think they were only like 34.99 guys 34.99 or 35.99 for a good puma leather gym shoe i didn't think that was too bad but because i really didn't need them i kind of opted out of it and then i was just looking and i ran across several other more that i thought was like really cute shoes and i saw these right here and I decided to get these in a size 8 because that's what I was looking for. Because the first one I showed you guys was the 8 and a half, which is my normal size. But then when I ran across those in the 8, they fit better. And then I was showing you guys these right here that I absolutely love. And I think they were only like $14.99 or something like that. But they like this um, snake skin, faux snake skin, you know, uh, little kind of wedge sandal or clog or whatever you want to call it and uh i opted not to get those then i'm just showing you guys these right here i thought they was cute and i think they were on like 12.99 and um uh, and then i think i've seen one more pair yeah these right here and they actually had texture to them guys and i think they was marked down to 16.99 or something like that so reasonable all of them were so reasonable and so after i got the shoes i put the eight and a half back in the pink avis the one i showed you guys and i end up getting the eight and i'm just telling you guys now that that's pretty much it i'm pretty much done looking in the shoes and i'm finna go over to the clothing and then i went over there and just peeped at a few dresses because y'all know how i am about any dresses that have like i call it the little floopity floop at the end but it's really like a ruffle or anything like that i think it's so cute on my body type and then i ran across the sweater dress and y'all think this was only like 10.99 and i was debating should i get it or not and you know honey anybody know that don't lose does has lost weight and still got a little arms on you gotta check them on baby so i don't care what it is a dress a shirt i have checked them on make sure it's gonna come on all this juice get out I, we got to cover all this juice right here that jenga lega that i'm getting rid of <laughs> i will be working on that honey uh until it's gone you heard me this pandemic really threw me off but i'm slowly finding myself getting back on track anyway that's not his or that so then i saw this little dress that i debated to get uh it was so simple but it had all the frillies that i like on it the arms and 
around the uh bottom portion but i opted out of it and then i just went on to the uh next row to see what i could see i really didn't see too much and i guess because i am an avid thrifter i don't need too much i ran across these hats and i am looking for a couple of uh fedora hats that i think i'm gonna have to order because my head that's what i'm telling you guys my head is so small that they don't fit and if it don't fit it don't sit on my head right it like slumps down y'all know how they can look y'all know how that is so i saw those two hats and i was just telling you guys i really liked them uh but they don't fit then i was telling you guys about this dress that i'm getting ready to show you guys right here it was just a simple plain black dress with uh gold embellished uh or rope i guess you would say around the neck part and then it came with that belt and it was only 10.99 but i in the end i really didn't need it so i opted out not to get it so i'm just telling you guys that's pretty much it on shopping with me at burlington hey and now we're going to do the haul do quick car haul because it's not that much y'all so i did go ahead and pick these on you cannot see i don't think the can y'all see the color oh my god i love that love that love that, love that. i did go ahead and pick these up they were 19.99 i did go ahead and pick these up as well these are so comfy and as soon as i get out i'm sliding these oh, i have on my workout gym shoes right now i'm sliding these bad boys on and then the only other thing i got was i just love these i did have a pair of earrings like this and they started to fade and i told my daughter this morning i said i need to find some more they're not exactly but they are so close so i got these and then i got these jessica simpson because they are in between like thick and thin and i just love them and both of those were 5.99 and that's all i got guys so we're gonna end the video here i'm finna run in doll tree i can't help myself anytime i'm close to a doll tree i have to run in so i'm finna run into this doll tree see what they have and then i will be heading home guys because i'm hungry i don't walk that little smoothly down so, as always, please be the solution to someone's problem child. Because there's some problem child out here. So, be the solution. Bye. I love you guys. I know this wasn't my normal haul. I do have a thrift haul coming up. I think the first one is going to have to be more of, I'm just going to have to show you guys because it's a lot. And I got to break it up and I'm going through. That's really why I haven't been on. I'm going through a lot of... You know how your change, your change style, your style change and you change and everything starts to change and you stuff that you once loved, you find you just don't love it like that anymore. And that's the joy of thrifting, guys. That's why I would encourage you, if you're going to spend money on something like clothes, see if you can thrift something that you really enjoy. It's going to, the quality is going to be magnificent. If you, if you're a touch person, you know quality so see if you can find something that you really uh enjoy first from the thrift store i'm not i'm not bashing shopping or anything you see i just came out of burlington but see if you can find good quality items that way you can save money especially you don't just go overboard you can save money so when the transition when you find yourself transitioning to something new it's not like you spent i know you still spent money on it but it's not like you spent a ton of money on it so you know what i'm saying i would rather trash something that i spent 6.99 on than trashing something that i spent 60.99 or 160.99 or 1699 on you know what i mean so of course i would resell that baby i ain't trashing but you know what i mean all right be the solution to somebody's problem bye i love you guys until next time a haul is coming.